Oh, I'm so all creepied out. Oh, disgusting. Look at my arm. Oh, God, I'm covered in grotesque monster parts. Hey, guys, how's it going? Whammo here. Welcome back to the forest. Now, we are sitting at the bottom of the sinkhole after fighting our way down here through a number of uh, big engamies, as you can see by the bottom right of the screen there. Even though I'm freezing to death, we have one, two, three, four, five, six pips of creepy armor, which is fan-freaking-tastic. I enjoy the crap out of that. So... We have to jump into this pit of eternal darkness. I know it's dark, and I'm sorry. I, I really do apologize for that, but it's it's just the nature of this game. Oh my god. Okay. Why did you not put your rebreather on? Is this the only pit in the game where you don't automatically put your rebreather on? Nice. Nice. Put that on pretty please. There we go. Now it's slightly less dark. And there it is. There is the hole in the ground. We want to go through this. Oh my god. That is terrifying. No thanks. Oh, a little laggy too. No thanks at all to that business right there. You gotta be brave AF to go through that thing. I mean, like, seriously, even with a scuba suit and everything on, like, no thanks. Squeezing through tight holes, underwater, like, no. That's, no. That's like three or four fears combined right there. Plus it's dark and shit. Yeah. Yeah, that's a lot of fears all bundled up into one. I, you could lose your crap right there, get all disoriented. Man, it, mm. There's a reason that cave divers have such a hazardous, uh, eh, profession? No, hobby. A lot of cave divers die every year from doing stuff like that, which is unfortunate. Divers as in actual divers, like underwater caves. Which is unfortunate, but, you know, you can tell. It, it would be a difficult thing to do. It'd be very easy to become disoriented or, you know, just your brain, your primal brain to just freak the fuck out. Not know where you're at and cause all kinds of problems. Where are we swimming to? I actually don't know. Ah, uh, maybe I do know. Okay, alright. Get out of the water. There you go. What wonders await us? Why do I hear burning? No, I hear drippy drips. Take that off pretty please. I hear drippy drips. What is this? What is that? Oh, scuba suit! Look, he's swimming underwater with the fishies! Oh, that's cute. Why, uh, why would you know that, little Timmy? I don't know why you would know anything like that. This is all very ominous. Very, very ominous. Oh, and it just got more ominous. I don't know, is it just me or does this have like a predator vibe to it? Kind of predatory, right? I don't know. What is down there? There's like body parts down at the bottom of that pool. Nice. There's some skull action. Nice narrow corridors. There's a guy down there too. What is this? Oh, probably a bad time to pick that up. Uh, key card. What are you? What does he have on his head? Put that picture away so we can kill this thing. Oh my god, he's wearing a mask. Is that a human mask? Oh, that is disturbing. That is all kinds of disturbing. You. No. Sit down. Sit down. You are just... You're not right. He's a fast one, but he's taking all kinds of hits. Yeah, he's definitely got a human face stitched to his skull. That's not cool. So the hierarchy is just regular top world mutants, uh, cave naked mutants, gray mutants, and then face mask mutants are the hardest of the tiers. Interesting. Huh. Although, you know, he still went down like a bitch because, you know, this is my range right here. He can't touch me in here. Whoop, get up on that. He can't touch me in that range. Can we please climb the thing? There you go. Interesting. Odd geography with the pillars and such. Maybe somebody carved this out. Yeah, I suppose somebody probably did carve this out, huh? Little worshipping tribe, you know, carving out caves in the ground and shit. How would they get in here without a rebreather, though? Without modern technology, how do they get into the cave? That's odd. I guess we're probably going somewhere here, huh? Yeah, here we go. This is what I wanted. There's some bones there. I haven't made any bone arrows. Have I made bone arrows yet? No, I don't think I have. Uh, not altogether too necessary. Also, did you see the eyeballs on my shoulder? Yeah, gross. Uh, bone arrows in and of themselves, not not altogether too necessary. Can I make this without having to make... Uh, I should probably just climb it. Uh, not too incredibly necessary. Uh, you, you can use them. However, I don't really use arrows as my main source of damage. And if I do need them, I just use flame arrows anyway. So, uh, Flame arrows always become wooden arrows regardless of what you make them from. So if you use even the modern arrows, if you use modern arrows to make flame arrows with the re crafting recipe, you uh, the flame arrows turn into wooden flame arrows. So, you know, altogether kind of useless. Sorry, my headphone cord is fucking with me here. There we go. There we go. Now we're good. Put away that Laura Croft axe and let us venture further into this little underwater. We're quite a ways under the map. I mean, we're pretty far underground. It would be very cold down here, that's for sure. I don't know. There's a lot of candles down here, so there's, there's definitely got some peoples down here. Hello? 
Are there any more mutants down here to be had? I will murder your entire tribe if I have to. I must find my Timmy. You must give me my Timmy. Give me my Timmy. This looks like a big boss fight area. Hey, how's it going? Let's go ahead and just run at me at full speed. Right into the front of my spear, which has some poison on it, I think. Are those... Look, they look like alien eggs from a distance. Those alien eggs over there? No? Just rocks. They're just rocks. No big deal. NBD. This looks like an area where you might fight an armsy or a legsy. Does it not? Lots of room... Room to move around. There's another fast one over there, I see. Lots of room. But, uh... There isn't one down here. That's odd. No, don't mind me. I'm just climbing like a kitty cat. Here we go. You can't get up here, you silly bastard. Hey, I'll come to you. I'll come to you. Just hold, hold on. There you go. Just stay right there. Stay right there. That'll work just fine. Perfect. Perfect. Nailed it. Good work, buddy. You tried. You tried your hardest. Are we going to have to do more diving? Oh, that dude just fell from the ceiling. Nice. I don't think we're going to have to do more diving. No, we should be good. Oh, it's another face mask one. He's They're fast, but they're not very... Yeah, they are strong. Mm -hmm. I don't know. They just have, seem to have more health. They don't really have anything else different about them. Also, I will... Uh-oh. The coldness is killing my stamina, so swinging a bunch isn't helping. There we go. Got him. Uh, let's not be cold anymore. Oh, running real low on supplies. Drink a soda pop, bring my stamina all the way back up to the tippy top. Uh, should save my blueberries until I'm out of the soda and energy drinks. Or energy bars. Yep, hold your lighter high. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Hmm. Is there a, Oh, there's a save point there. Is there a place we are heading here? I hear... I hear something. What is that? Is that a guy in the water? He is in the water! You tricksy bastard. You're not supposed to be, like, worshipping underwater. Oh, it sounded like there was more than one, but there's not. Ah, easy. Easy, buddy. Hold on, let me just kill this guy. There we go. Just a few stabby stabs, and he's got some dodge action to him. Ooh, that should've hit. Oh, 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 not great. Combo. Wombo combo. Can't touch me. Yeah, didn't even take away a pip of armor. Yeah, creepy armor is stupid good. Let me save the game. Not that I'm necessarily concerned about dying, but... I am concerned about dying. <laughs> so that's a thing. Ooh, we're getting there. We're getting in there. Shee, many Christmas. What is... There's just like... What is this? What are these things? They're like metal pieces, like, built into the side of the cave. I... Yeah. I don't... I don't know what they are. They're like... Fuck, yeah, they're just metal in the cave. All right. All right. Okay. I don't even know what to think about that. It's like a door in the middle of a red painting. Uh, what is this? Oh, need a key card, huh? Where does one acquire said key card? Can I acquire key card somewhere? Well then, I guess we missed the key card. Must suck to come all the way down here and not have a key card, huh? Damn it! <laughs> well, I'll see you where the key card's at then. Yeah, there's the next cave. All right, should have done this first, but uh, you know, even the best laid plans, such and such, so on and so forth. Whatever, you won't get to see the travel time, so it's no big deal, right? Here, yeah. Even though it is like the biggest amount of travel time there ever could possibly be. Oh, look, a nice little handy save point in here with a lot of sticks, because that took me a bit of effort. There's no doubt. Let's light this fire too. Do I have any food on me? God, I hope I do. Uh, nope, sure don't. And there's a videotape which we won't even bother looking at. Yeah, that's a thing. All right. Onward into the cave of greatness. We are down here uh, to get that key card. Yeah, I guess I suppose it wouldn't be that long for you guys, so you know. You know. Uh, do we need to go that way? Is there anything useful down there? I don't know. Let's keep going this way first. Keep going this way first to avoid the crawl. Ugh, oof. I don't know. That might be the way we're supposed to go, but we'll see what's down here. Uh, IRC, it's a fairly uh, small cave. So. Oh, Fucking god damn it, son of a... Ah, bats, so scary. Bats, why are you so scary? Why are you so scary, bats? Why are you so scary? Oh, yeah? You guys having a gay old time down there, are you? I'll just bust out this right here. Uh, switch over to my fire arrows, if you please, and light that on fire. There you go. Excuse me, just hold on, guys. Let me just, uh... What the shit? Well, let's get down there. Let's get in this fight. Come on, you bastards. I'll take you all on with my bare hands. 
with my bare hands. Hey guys, how's it going? Remember me? Yeah, I'm the guy that was standing up there earlier, shooting arrows at you. Oh, I hit him. Nice. Solid tech. Solid tech. Do you want something? Huh? 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 That's right, you run away. Run away. Come on. Come on. What the fuck? Why is it? Why do you go into chanting mode? Did I miss something, buddy? Oh, I missed that. That's what I did. There we go. <laughs> I, uh... I suppose that works. I don't, uh... Yeah. Huh. Weird. Anyway, back to what we were doing. I don't know why he ran away from me and started chanting. That's odd. Oh, you know what? It's because I'm painted. I got painted in the other room. I forgot about that. Uh, no. Let's not go that way. You see that my hands and stuff are red. Which makes enemies less likely to attack you. They're more afraid of you uh, when you're like this. One of these paths is the correct way. One is not. Uh, yeah, let's try this one. Fuck it. Worst case scenario, we have to go back. Oh, whalesies. Ah. Yes, I do think this was the right path. Uh, inventory, please. Molotov, please. Uh, light that pretty good, please, sir. There we are. That Armsy down there is gonna be dealt with in short order. Armsy. Uh, Armsy, buddy. Come back over here. Uh, fuck! Ah, don't die! We're fine. We're fine. We're fine, no worries. No worries, just a little bit of health damage. Here, have this. Uh, cause I don't want it. Oh, I guess I should have mentioned, there is some nudity here. Hmm. I might have to blur all that out. Uh, we fought the RMZ. The RMZ was fought. Now we need to go get a key card, which is buried back in here. I think I know where it's at. Okay, that's the key card. See it? There it is. Yeah, there's some nudity down in this body pile. I'm actually not going to show that, uh, thinking about it. So, yeah. We came down here, killed an RMZ. That was the key card. Now we got to get back out. Oh, you know what? I'll just meet you at the keycard door. How about that? Well, there goes all my blueberries. Just ate every last bit of blueberry I have. But hey, I got a full stomach now, which is, you know, a lot better than how we came into this last time. You guys, you guys don't even know. It's like a 15, 20 minute run to go from the keycard to this, and I had to do that shit twice. But, we finally have it. Okay, so what did we pick up before we came into here? We picked, that's the wrong button, whammo. Get good at the game. We picked something up. We picked up a picture. Ah. We picked up this picture. What was on the back of that? There was something on the back of that. Before we uh, got to this door. I don't know if that's relevant or not, but uh... Oh, drawings is what it says. I thought it just said RAR. RAR! Like it was on the back of this picture or something. Okay. So that's what we picked up before we came up here. Let's just pretend that I just did that. Oh, look at this! I just found a picture! Oh my goodness, what could this possibly mean? Ah, oh, fuck. There's a light bulb broken too. Can you please put it away? I got it. I got it. Put it away. There you go. And key card? Oh, thank goodness. It's the right key card. It's all bloody and nasty. Oh, I thought I just crashed. Really concerned there for a second. Oh. Oh. <laughs> well, that would be what the drawing is of. I think we can put this lighter away. Uh, yeah. Wow. This just got a little bit more umbrella than I thought it would. Oh, look. A nice, uh, well, I guess it's yellow, so what would yellow be? I don't know, a yellow power tool and some more red paint. Let's just paint ourselves red again. Not that we're covered in creepy armor or anything, so it really doesn't matter. Fucking Jesus. Alright, well, uh... Up the rope, I guess. The rope is kind of out of place in all this metal and fine walls and shit. But, uh, I suppose whatever. You know, you kind of expect it to be a ladder. Uh, what's over here? Let's go check over here first. Make sure we're not missing anything. Uh, I got some meds, some bones, and some more meds. Okay, so they want us to be full health, whatever the case. Whatever we may be coming into in this, um, umbrella facility. Alright. Hmm. Running back above the orange room. Yeah, okay, I guess we... Drop it. Oh! I missed the soft containers. Ow. A wrench, nice spanner there. Interesting. Uh... I see you there. I see you looking at me. I don't know what I expected. I... I Guess I just didn't expect this to open automatically. That actually exploded. I'm pretty sure that said nitrogen on the side of it, but you know, maybe I'm just stupid. Yeah, no, it definitely says nitrogen, which, uh, yeah, it doesn't explode. What is all this? Something about Megan, Megan, Megan. Oh, look, here, we can just pick it up and actually look at it. Get your stupid hand out of the way, idiot. Jesus. Uh, yeah, Megan. 
Something about Megan. We're still cold, I will note. So we're still shivering. Uh, where does this put us? Oh, into the vents. Leaky, leaky vents. Uh-huh. Definitely a facility of some nature. Hello? What might be over here? Oh. Oh. What the hell? It's like a, a child's little uh, hideaway room here with lots of cloth, knives, uh, bottles of pills, <laughs> and uh, a book titled Mickey Tells Lies. Uh-huh. Well then, this kid was set. I mean, just down here tweaking on some Tylenol or something. Fucking <laughs> Man, parenting. Hard to do. Or I guess maybe the kids just got out when this all went sideways, which I imagine it did. At some point here, I don't know. Something had to go wrong here, otherwise we would have seen somebody right now, right? There would have been people in here. I would think, anyway. Okay. Yeah, no, something definitely went wrong here. This umbrella facility had an issue. Oh, look at that. Oh, so they know that there's legsies. What does that say? May not be enough? Uh-huh. Interesting. This is all very interesting. Yeah. All very good stuff. Very good stuff. Who staples a periodic table of elements on their poster board? Like, seriously. Do the people doing this kind of stuff not know they're where their element is that they need to be thinking about? Kind of doubt it. Kind of... Oh. Oh, lips. Getting all lipsy on this drinking thing here. <laughs> just all lips. Can't do anything. I'm just all lips. Is there anything different around here? Like, get, get out of the way, trash can. What is that? What is that a picture of? It's a picture of a door. One of those crazy doors. Huh. Maybe one of the doors we came through. I don't know. Eh. I want to see these pictures up close. Well, that one's kind of floating, but you know, whatever. Whatever. How to be a good neighbor. Oh my god, regular food! Oh, yeah. Oh my god. Oh, regular food. Regular. Is there more regular food? Give me more regular food. D-I-S-O regular food. Oh, what is this? Oh, we can get coffee? Oh, fuck yeah, I get some coffee and more regular food. I'm just gonna eat everything. I'm not even hungry. I'm just eating regular food. What is... Can we... Hey, the vending machines still work! How much... I don't know how much money I have, but... We're gonna keep putting money in here and getting sodas out of it, I suppose. How many... How many sodas do I need? Uh, okay. So let's just keep... How many freaking sodas did I have? Missing! From my inventory. There we go. Finally max out on sodas. Ooh, look, I can get snacks, too. Let's max out on snacks, too. I think I finally ran out of money. Snack, 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 snack. Well, I guess I didn't need any more snacks, so let's go ahead and just, uh, eat and eat. There we go, topped off. Some booze, too. Oh man, we are golden. Oh, now I have enough money. I apparently, yeah, didn't collect a lot of money. So, I didn't think I'd ever need it. I'm just eating everything in this room and pushing chairs all over the place. Yeah, this place was destroyed when I got here, but I'm making it worse. Because, uh, that's who I am. What can I say? All kinds of dranky dranks. Yeah, more snack machines. Uh, what is that? I can sit down? Huh. Look at him sitting down like he's people. He's not people. Uh, what's in here? I expected that to open. Is that not gonna open? Oh. Okay. Something went bad here. Something went very bad here. Oh, I see. Yeah! Get away! Get away, chair! So get out of the way, chair. There we go. Nice strong pipes lead us back into the ductwork again. You know, getting a lot of use out of these uh, hidden passageways in the ceilings, aren't you? Okay. I, I don't know what to think of that. I guess that would imply that there were children up here at some point, right? Which is a curious thing in and of itself. Megan was the chair, child that was said to be missing, right? Oh! I think I was supposed to land on that pipe, but you know. You can only do so much. Oh, this this is in much worse repair than the other area was. What is that? Magazine of some kind. Uh, ethical scientists. Ancient artifacts. Can this device bring back the dead? Huh. It's an artifact somewhere in here, and I don't know what it is. Do I have a code that I can put in to open that door? No, I don't, I don't think so. I don't think that's me actually pushing buttons. Okay. Interesting. Very interesting. There's... It's implied that there were children here, right? Yeah. They were doing something with kids. What they were doing with kids, though. That's the big question. Yeah, when I grow up, I want to be a lawyer. These are all children's books. There's action figures and Barbies lying around everywhere. Hmm. 
None, none of Timmy's action figures, though. There's a there's a baby out there, an enemy. Uh, yeah. What does that imply? That's not cool. Ow! Fucking goddamn babies. There's dead ones here already. Ooh. Observation room four. Well, this isn't good at all. B was that not a four? A. Why did I think that said four? Am I retarded? I think I might be. Yeah, I think I might be a little slow. Yep, that's what just happened right there. Uh. Why do we have observation rooms? They knew this was going wrong then. I say they. Whoever was running this place knew something was going wrong. Because we have dead bodies here. Yeah, like, uh, containing something. S something was being contained. I, mean, I don't know what. Oh, that's an armsy. Hi, armsy. Excuse me while I just go through this way again. Can you get through that door? Uh, armsy? <laughs> nope, sure can't. Ah, <laughs> Guess who's gonna win this one, buddy? It's not you. You're not gonna win this one. No, you're not. This works well. Oh. He's not too happy about this. Also, I am still wet and cold. Alright, buddy. Get a swing off and we're gonna run by you. Yeah, Run by you there. There we go. You stop that. Stop being a dicker. You dicker. There we go. Got him taken care of. No big deal. Give me that arrow back. And we will take the creepy armor. Did he take a pip of creepy armor away from me? I don't think he did. I think we were sitting pretty good. We need to take another pills here. Put on that pip of creepy armor. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pips of creepy armor I have. Wow. We were getting fully creepy armored. Wow, they had a lot of observation rooms with all kids stuff in there. Did they mutate kids somehow? How are they mutating kids? What the fuck? How are they doing this stuff? I don't get it. Can, can I? Please. Please, dead body. Let me out of here. Let, what the fuck? Wow, he had a bad day, didn't he? Huh. Of all the rooms that are broken, this one's not. Guess so that glass is a lot stronger than it looks, huh? Interesting. Oh, no. What are they doing with... What is going on here? All kinds of crazy shit. Property of Megan. Who is Megan? Why am I still cold? Really wish I wasn't still cold and wet. So there's a girl here named Megan. Okay. Interesting. Huh. Megan Cross. Oh, that is... We've been picking up stuff about the whole Cross family around this area. Uh, and throughout the game, actually. Uh, hold on. Wait. Wait, I'll show you. Wait. Presented by Dr. Matthew Cross, PhD. So, Matthew Cross worked at Sahara and he knew these things were here. Like, they knew these things were here. There's no doubt. They were actively, uh, mm, yeah, encouraging them to grow, actively creating them. Maybe not creating them, but definitely actively just doing stuff with them. What? It, okay, it's a drawing of that, I think. Whatever that is, and whatever that is, too. Jeez, a lot of weird shit in here. A lot of very weird stuff. It's a very big lore dump, actually. We could probably go into detail about that, too, couldn't we? Yeah, whilst we're looking around the facility. So Matthew Cross has a wife. And I don't know her name. I could probably look it up if I wanted to. But his wife was uh, murdered uh, by him. <laughs> it is assumed, anyway. Uh, because they were using their child for testing, basically. And uh, what does that say? Uh, that's him being terminated right there. That's Matthew being terminated from the company. They found out he was being unethical with his child, and uh, he murdered his wife, and yeah, things just went bad. Is he carrying a knife? He had a knife or a stick or something. Yeah, things went very bad for uh, for Matthew very quickly. And then, uh, yeah, he was here. We'll get further on to that whole story elements when we get to it, but you'll see. It's a whole thing. He used his kid in these experiments. Die, little baby things. There we go. Ow, fuck. Is there still another one alive? Stupid little babies. There we go. Yeah, he was using his kid for an experiment of some nature. Okay, well, this is the thing, huh? Definitely the thing that was on the drawing. Let's not open that right away. To second artifact, this is the artifact. Oh, this is what they were talking about. I gotcha. In interesting. There's something in there. Is that... There's someone in there. All right. Let's see if we can go anywhere else before we open that, though. I don't think so. 
I think we are stuck into this. Well, let's open the artifact, I guess. Let's see what's in here. I don't know how we're gonna open it exactly, but... Yeah? Oh, it's Timmy! Hi, Timmy! You seem like you might have had a better day, but, uh... Is he alive? Oh, God, we're covered in red paint and creepy armor. So this is how you want him to see you. Ew. He seems pretty dead. New sample required. Ah. Wait. So in order to save him, we have to put a new sample in there. What does the book say about this? What are your thoughts on this, my friend? Because I am very curious. Holy shit, find a new sacrifice. Hmm. Ooh, that's... Interesting. If that's what you used to sacrifice to bring somebody back to life, then Timmy himself was a sacrifice to bring someone else back to life who was being experimented on, probably. Cough? <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's implied that Timmy was used to bring Megan back. And it appears you have to use... Oop. You have to use a human sacrifice in order to bring people back to life. You have a mask on. I do not like masked versions of you. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Go on. Go on, get. Ouch. Get. Get. No. Get. 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 Stop it. Stop it. These guys, you kind of block with a spear. When you swing at the right time, you'll block a hit too, which is super convenient. What did that other way point to? It said to second artifact. Can we get to the second artifact? Well, we can't get in there. That's not kind of shitty. No, we need a, uh, we need a hockey puck to get to the second artifact. <laughs> a hockey puck. Okay, cool. Also, I didn't see this room. What's in here? Oh, there's another videotape. Some more paint. What is this? What? Oh. Uh, what does that say? Oh, we believe the device may be able to bring down a plane. Ah, uh huh. Our plane was brought down by something, and this says Daddy's dead. And he's covered in... What are those? Crayons? Oh, my goodness. Uh, lots of paintings and pictures by Megan. Megan. Daddy's killed by crayons. Megan may have killed Daddy. But how would Megan kill Daddy? And Daddy... This guy is Matthew, who is the one who abducted Timmy, to bring Megan back, and then Megan killed him. Alright. Story's coming together. <laughs> Starting to figure it out at least a little bit, I guess. Where do we find the hockey puck? Timmy, you hold tight, bud. We're gonna go get a new sacrifice for you. Uh, la -dee -da. uh I need a hockey puck. Alright. Keep your eyes peeled for a hockey rink. It has to be around here somewhere. They have to have been playing hockey at some point. Because, uh, you know, no modern company runs without playing hockey. I also should probably should get some more money. Which, <laughs> money is always in the couch cushions. You can always count on that. Well, there's not any in there. Just, oh my god, there's tons of money in here. A fucking rich bastard sat on this chair. Nice! This way I can stay topped off on uh, food and drink, you know? You know how it goes. There we are. Topped off on soda pops and uh, snacky snacks. Very, very good. Very, very good. What's in here? Oh. Just cloth, and cloth, and cloth, and circuit boards, and circuit boards, and circuit boards. Oh, just a little supply room. Okay. 
That's cool. Yeah. I didn't need any of it, but uh, that's that's all right. What did, what updated on the... Oops, that's wrong. Wow. This, after seeing this nice, pristine lab, is like, gee, many Christmas. Although I do have a chainsaw in here, so, you know, it's it's whatever. Why did I get a chainsaw? I don't know. Fuck it. Who cares? What did you cross off the to-do list? Uh, well, you found Timmy. I'm still find a new sacrifice. Okay. Must have crossed the trigger for something else. Were these footprints here before? Oh, shit, they were. Oh. Hmm. Megan. Megan. We need you for something. Come here, girl. Uh, do we need anything in here? I don't think so. No, I think, I think we're pretty set. We've got, we got pretty much everything. What does this say? Oh, daddy. Red man. He's... She must have thought Matthew was evil or something. Which I suppose he experimented on her, so it's not all that surprising. Who in their right mind would sleep on this? Seriously, in the middle of this area, there's bloody footprints walking by, for God's sake. Why would you sleep on that? It just seems like a bad life choice right there. Interesting. Inter oh, yeah. Yep. Yep. Look at this nice boss fighting arena we're going to have here. This is cute. All right. Well, since we're doing this, let's go ahead and just... Uh, are we maxed out on arrows? Can we hold any more? Uh, no. We are maxed out on arrows. Good. Okay, we got all the arrows. I'm going to make some more flaming arrows, too. All right. Maxed out on flaming arrows. Maxed out on molotovs. I think we're good to go, then. If this is indeed an area that I think it is, which would involve a boss fight. Can I use the chainsaw on a boss? That doesn't seem very viable or necessarily a good idea. Pondering if I need to do anything else? Nope. I think we are uh, good. You can put that lighter away now. I don't think you need to have that out anymore. Let us go see what's going to happen here. Oh, what the fuck? Was I in that cave? Is that a cave that's under us? Uh, did I see that cave at some point? I don't know. Would I have known if there was a glass ceiling above a cave that I was walking through? Probably, right? I mean, you'd think so. I don't know. What the, what's, go oh, there's somebody over there. Hello? Megan? Do you want to come with me, hun? We gotta go, uh, gotta go slappy in a big old machine that's lots of fun. Hey, girl. Hey, we gotta slap you in a machine. That's lots of fun. What are you doing? You playing with an airplane? Oh, that's cute. You made some drawings. And you're making weird noises, too. Megan, hey. Hey, we gotta go put you in a machine. You're all bloody. You must have killed daddy. Oh, and you ate him, apparently. Okay. Yeah, that's what happened. My plane crashed. How did you know? Okay. All right. Oh my goodness. Hi. <laughs> the tentacle monster wants a piece. <laughs> I see what you're reaching for there. All right. That's a thing. You're very loud. Time to run away. Yeah, we're doing this thing. Run away, please. Run away. We use our most powerful weapons first, being the spears. Chucky Chuck. I missed that one. Oh my goodness! No, please get up. Please get up. Please get up. Run away. Run, run away. There, I hit him. Nice. Nice. Come on. Come on, you bastard. Ah, no jumps. Ah, dodge. Yeah. No. No. What the... What the fuck is that? Ow, also. That hurt a lot. Please block those. Ow, fuck. You got some stompy stomps on you there. Okay. Okay. We're gonna do this. Come on. Jump at me again. Do it. Do it. I dare you. That took down so much creepy armor. Oh, you're spitting out babies? Not cool. Not cool at all. Come on, then. Come on, then. What do you got? Oh, God, I'm out of spears. I'm already used them all. Easy. Easy. Let's circle around. No, 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 no. Don't want none of that. All right, let's try these, then. Let's try some flaming arrows. Let's see how you like flaming arrows, girl. Oh, shit. Light the arrow, please. You do that really slow. Here we go. Fire! Oh, yeah. Ow! Fuck! No, 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 no,
trying to light this arrow at the same time as you're running. Yeah, it's like a cross pattern on the keyboard. No! Do not want that. Took down another Pippa Creepy Armor. Yeah! Did I miss that? Shit. Light the arrow. Okay. Okay. We just gotta watch out for these babies, too. Babies are still on the field. Here we go. Fire arrow! Ha ha ha! You got nothing on my fire arrow, Tech. Keep circling. Keep circling. Light the arrow. Keep circling. Here we go. Watch out for the babies. We're good. We're good. One more fire arrow. Oh, yes. Seems these have penetration on them, too. You notice they'll go right through her. That's good, I suppose. No! Did I dodge that? I didn't get hit by it. Uh, ah. Yeah, another hit. That's what I'm talking about. I think this is going well. I think we're doing good. The side circling is working well, I think. No. Here we go. Ah. There we are. There we are. Shit. Got to take a hit of that. Get up. Get up, buddy. Get up. Get up. We're fine. We're fine. Get the weird cross angle on the keys. I'm using my thumb to hit the L key while strafing and holding the sprint, which is very, very odd. No. Don't want. Here we go. There we go. Another nice shot. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Get another light going on here. This is, uh, this is working out well. I kind of expected to die to this at least once, but I think we might, oh my god, be able to do it. No. No, 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 no. Light the arrow again, please. I'm glad I made all these flaming arrows. They are definitely coming in handy. No, no, no. Oh, easy, Megan girl. Easy. I need you to bring Timmy back to life. I'm going to burn your body and then we're not going to bring Timmy back because you're going to be all charred and shit. That's okay, though. We're going to be done with this here in a second. There we go. Shit, that was a miss. Uh, can I light? I'm, I'm not out of flaming arrows yet. Still got a few to go. Watch out for the babies. No babies. No babies. Okay, here we go, you gangly ass bastard. Don't hit me with that. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. Shit, missed another flaming arrow. It's not good. Ugh. Can't keep missing these. I am getting pretty good at dodging her, though. Getting, or I'm getting fairly lucky. Here we go. Fuck! Come on. Come on. Gotta make these hits. Missed three in a row now. What are you doing? What are you, why are you standing there? What are you doing? There we go. There we go! Oh, music ends and we are done with that, boss. Alright, now I just need to kill off all the little babies running around everywhere. Babies go away. Babies go away. Is there any more? I, I hear more. There's one. Two. Come here. Come here, little babies. Are you still making noise? All right, stop. 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 We're done. Oh, we got her. We got her. We can get out of here. We're done. We got we got the Megan girl. We can go revive Timmy. We can do the revival of Timmy. Wow, that was that was something, huh? What the hell happened to her? She was definitely having some kind of experimental things done on her. I don't know. It's very dead spacey with the uh, marker and like the genetic mutation and shit. So I guess now we just follow the footprints back to the uh, to the artifact then, right? We, I mean, we got Megan. Yeah, I don't know. She might be dead. Uh, is she dead? I, fuck, I don't know. Pretty sure we killed her, but whatever. That's fine. Let's just throw her in the machine and see what happens, I suppose. In you go, Megan. In you go. In you go, girl. Let's go ahead and, okay, we'll just, we'll just use our magical powers to put you in there. Perfect. Nailed it. Good to go. Close her up. Close. Oh, that's not good. We need a live sample. Okay, how do we get a live sample for Timmy? What did you drop? Is that... It's another key card. It's a gold key card. Wow, fascinating and shiny. What the... Uh, oh, she got... Ooh, look at her back. It's all cut open and shit. Ew, grody. Hold on, Timmy, buddy. We're gonna get you a live sample somehow. I don't know how. Put that stick away. What are you gonna do with that? Was that the key card to open this door? Oh. Apparently it was. It was the hockey puck. Doesn't look a lot like a hockey puck, but it works for me. Let us go see what the second artifact has in store for us, shall we? I don't know. It's something that can shoot down a plane, does that mean it's like a gun of some nature? Uh, very large cannon? I don't, I don't know. Give me my lighter, please. I don't... Light the lighter. Jesus. Took you long enough. Uh, it could be all kinds of stuff. What the hell is going on there? Uh, maybe it's a giant trebuchet. You're trebucheting down airplanes. A catapult, if you will. Uh, going back into the caves again. I don't like that. No, put me back in the facility. The facility was all nice and shiny and air-conditioned. Who wants to be in caves? It's gross. Alright, fine. I don't know why this is here. Another gear check, I suppose. Just in case you manage to make it this far without actually having all the gear. Down we go. Are we going to encounter any stronger enemies in here, I wonder? How... Where's the ground at? Uh, there it is. Just let go of the wall. Perfect. Are we going to encounter any uh, anything more substantial than 
Armsies and legsies? Oh, well I guess we gotta swim again too. Interesting. Some scuba tanks. We can go ahead and just refill ours and then hop right up or in or in Kablunk! Good, it auto put it on this time. That's nice. Uh, this will wash off our red paint, which is unfortunate, but I don't know how many more enemies we're going to encounter. Uh, you'd think there'd be at least some down here, stronger enemies. I mean, I don't have any more creepy armor pips, and I'd really like to kill a few armsies in order to get some more creepy armor, but... I suppose if we're nearing the completion, we may not even need to kill anything. We'll see. Where in goodness name are we going here? Uh, we're gonna be cold and wet again, which means we're gonna be shivering. Nope, it's, it's, it is indeed up. Up we go! Out of the water. Okay. Take that off pretty please. Oh, another one of these things, huh? Oh look, they're nice enough to put a bunch of rocks here. Let's just open that all the way up. Fuck it. It doesn't even matter. Hello? That's very dark. Hello? What the fuck? Why are there a bunch of dead people in here? Oh my god, is this where the facility went to- Lighter? Please. Is this where the facility went to hide? Is this where all the employees, like, tried to take refuge? What? What could have possibly killed them then? There's no... It's like they just died where they stood. I don't understand. What, what could have killed them down here? Would it have been the monsters? No, because they would have been like crushed up or beaten. These guys seem like they're like suffering as they die. What uh, What's down here? Before I go forward, or maybe this is forward, I'm not sure. I do know there's a thing pointing here, so that, that means something, right? There's gotta be something down here? Does there have to be something down here? I don't... I don't know. Uh, some sort of like Stonehenge thing, but... Doesn't explain how all those people died. I don't see anything else. At least nothing else interesting. I don't know, do you guys do you guys see anything I'm missing? I just see a big pool with a big Stonehenge style thing in the middle of it. Maybe this is where they extracted the marker from. Marker? Yeah, marker. Artifact. <laughs> Maybe that's where the artifact was, was right there and then they took it out. I don't, uh, I don't know. It seems the entire facility retreated into here when shit went bad, and then all proceeded to die in rather unassuming ways. Weird. There's coffee cups and shit down here, like, maybe they were living down here for a while or something. Boy, I don't know. Yeah, there's lanterns and stuff. Like, it's very odd. Like, it was a storage facility or something? Hmm. Why would you store stuff in a cave? I don't know. These are all questions we probably will never get answers to. But, questions you should ask nonetheless, right? Oh, another squeeze. Yay, squeezes! What is on the other side of this one? Are we gonna get back in the facility? Because I would really like to get back in the facility. They, I don't... The caves are kind of done. I'm, oh, hey, look. <laughs> Convenient. Uh, also, did they, they must have built this thing into the ground then. Yeah, they must have built this facility into the caves. Uh, oh, hey. Well, there you go. That, uh, we're here. We're on level s G. Level G. I was gonna say 6. It, may, it could be a 6 or a G, but it's probably a G. So there's the cave system level, and we're down on the bottom. We're all the way at the bottom of the facility. Oh. Yeah, the cannibals really had fun in here, didn't they? I don't, uh... I don't. If you're opposed to gore and, uh, naked dead bodies, you probably should look away now, because I'm not gonna censor this part. We're gonna walk through this. So there's piles of dead people everywhere. Uh... Yeah, this went bad real quick, for sure. And then the, I don't know, the ones that lived, the ones that mutated, like, killed everyone and piled their corpses up? Yeah, it's, it's very dead space. I don't see any more enemies, although I did hear some stuff. Very interesting. Okay. More orange room, huh? I think we can put this away now. Do we have the ability to open the door? I guess we do. Uh, what floor are we going to? Do we pick? Or... No. Okay. We don't even pick what floor we go to. I'm gonna stand in the back of the elevator. Seems like a good idea. And we'll go ahead and switch to regular arrows so at least we have a somewhat modern weapon. Bring it on, whatever ye might be. 
Huh. What the fuck? So we went up to the observation level then, huh? I think we would have seen this facility from the forest, but I guess not. Wow. Elaborate. Fucking no expense spared. Wow. Okay. That's very, very interesting. That there would be this huge... Yeah, you should be able to see this from out there. That's we Oh, weird. This is somebody's office. Okay. Uh... What is this place? It's all very odd. I like the styling, but still. Very odd. Who would want an office in here? Can you hear this thing? It's very loud. Very loud and obnoxious. Uh... What is all this? What? That's... Sally Kevin Thomas. These are matches for bringing Timmy back to life. How does the machine know what I want to do? And gee, many Christmas, man. So, I, I guess we can bring Timmy back. But that... But that doesn't seem to be the right thing to do. Emergency shutdown? I like how this is hastily set up over here. So do we shut it down? Or do we shoot down an aeroplane? You know what? I never really liked Timmy anyway. We're not gonna save him. Nope. Fuck Timmy. Fuck Timmy. We're gonna shut it down. Shut her down. Yes, I'm sure. Push you the button. Turn this thing off. It has claimed enough lives and caused enough trouble. Push the button. Push the damn button. Oh, so much more peaceful now. See, now you could work in this office and it'd be a really cool office to have. That's better. We're good now. Yeah? We good? It's off? Yep, it's all turned off. We are, uh, we're good to go. Alright, we've done our job here. Let's go home. Everybody, good work. I don't know how we're gonna get home, but, uh, surely this experience won't have scarred us for life. Right? So yeah, I don't know. Hmm. This is all very odd. Well, jump in the water then. Yeah, there's always, there's always something with you guys, huh? We gotta do the water, and we gotta do all kinds of crazy crap. There's two ways to go. Odd. Let's go left first, because left first always does well. Oh, well. We didn't actually need to be swimming. So that's something. Get out of the water. Keep a rebreather on for the moment. Because you never know... What might be around the corner. Uh-huh. Well, well, fuck it. Let's go down here and see what's going on down in this area, down yonder way. <laughs> Why? Why is there a little crawl right there? Doesn't even make sense. I guess if we get stuck down in the hole. These flares? These are, historically, those have been flares. I never use flares. What is that? What is going on in there? Something making noise in there. Oh, jeez. Oh, just, there's something in there. I can see it with my eyeball holes. Is there a way I can clip through this wall and not have to get whatever it is to open this door? You know what? I'll just spoil it for you. Out on the yacht in the ocean, there is a, uh, there's another artifact you can pick up. It's like a big dagger thing that you jam into this hole. And then you go into this door and you pick up a little spiky ball thing that you push into the ground. It makes enemies spawn or it makes enemies not spawn. Based on whatever you might want to do. It's an end game item. One of those things that you use when you've built a base and everything in this game. Which I have yet to show you guys, actually, but yeah. <laughs> I think we need to, uh, make our way out of this cave, finally. Fre freedom <laughs> Perfect. Or not. Oh, yeah. No, we're good. We're good. Oh, we are definitely good. Where does this put us at? Uh, out in the cold, apparently. Out in the very cold. Oh. Hey, look, there's that airplane we didn't blow up. Hi, airplane. Wave. Wave at the three kids on that airplane that you saved. Oh, it's so sad. So sad, but Timmy had to die, unfortunately, to end this story. Hey, there's Timmy! You a spiky-haired little bastard. Oh, yeah. Well, what... What are you gonna do it? Oh, really? Wait. Ah, he's saying goodbye to Timmy. Say goodbye to Timmy. Don't burn yourself. You're gonna burn yourself. You're gonna burn yourself. All right. I guess he's not going to burn himself.
There goes Timmy. Ah, a, a happy end, dot, 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 question mark. That's as far as we go, guys. I will leave the cinematics for the ending if you kill the kids on the airplane at the end of the video. But that's all I got for you. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. This was Forrest, a great little game. I liked it a lot. I thought it was great for an indie game. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Press to confirm. Oh, he looks at the picture of Timmy. Of course he does. Hit it. Boom. Boom? Oh, you have to hit it too. Do I? Yep. Oh, I think we both have to hit it at the same time. Oh my god. Yep. There it goes. Confirmed. We're shooting down another airplane. I'm, I'm holding, holding up my lighter, lighter as in, <laughs> in tribute. <laughs> That's fantastic. Do it. Hit the button. Hit the button, pussy. He, he's taking his sweet ass time. Boop. Oh, there it goes. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, boy. Jesus, it's like an EMP. Yeah, it is. That's awesome. Whoa. Well, you can hear it coming. Where's the airplane? There it is. Holy crap. <laughs> it went right by us. A oh, year later? Straight up skip to the fucking epilogue. Wow. He did it. Yep. And Timmy's all jittery. Please give it up for Eric LeBlanc. Something not right with Timmy. Uh huh. Why well, do you have an axe? <laughs> That's one hell of a story. So let's jump right into it. Oh, something wrong with him. You've written oh, God. I got my ass. He's gonna try to duel us. Like He's gonna cut down a log. <laughs> Here we go. Timmy? What? what kiss the axe. Uh oh. Is he okay? No, he's not okay. Oh boy. Yep. <laughs> yep. Is this the good ending? Oh, Timmy. He's dying in front of my what? arms. Did he just straight up die? No. I feel like there's two versions of that. Um. I feel like there's two versions of that. One where he turns and the other where he doesn't. Yeah. That was excellent, though. That was great. What an ending. Oh my god, I didn't wow. expect that shit. What? Huh. Still going? <laughs> oh! Timmy! Ah, so he's obsessed with it. Yeah, see? Oh, wow. Whoa, what's going on? Maybe he has control over it or something? Or it's gonna happen in the city. Ah, there's the end, there's the end. 